Commander, there is something we should discuss if you are finished rewriting history. I made my decision, Counselor. There's not much anyone can do about it now. Take that! Yes. We're going to have billions more Krogan in the galaxy. It's a good thing you saved my life once, Shepard. Otherwise, well... Not nothing you can do about it now, buddy! I about humanity's representative, Counselor Udina. My agents have discovered that he's using his authority to move vast sums of money. For what purpose? We're not sure. If Udina's dirty, it's best we get to the bottom of it fast. Agreed. Come to the Citadel. We will review the evidence and discuss this in private. Why did he Never come to out. me? Because I'm a Spectre? Commander, Admiral Hackett's available on Bitcoin. How about that? He does that. Commander Shepard, something you need to talk about? What's our state of readiness, Admiral? I won't lie, Shepard. We're bogged down. Things aren't looking good in most sectors. We need to increase the tempo and chalk up some wins, otherwise... This won't end well for the human race. Or any race. What about the extra help we picked up along the way? The Krogan and Turians have obviously been a big help. Heard not Rex running the show is a bonus for us. Had that female Krogan you rescued survived, she might have rallied more support from the clans, but I'll take what we can get. I'm glad you disabled that bomb on Tachunka. We could have lost a lot of Krogan support. As it is, we picked up some Turian troops. Good to hear. Whoa. What about Arya's mercenaries? Arya Talok, there's someone I never thought we'd be in bed with. The blood pack will be useful and violent. Mostly Vorcha, I hear. We'll put the Blue Suns to good use. Intel says Darner Vosk is bringing his men and that they're gunning for a fight. The Eclipse are providing troops and mechs. When we find a Reaper soft spot, they'll help us hit it. Don't want to know how you got Arya's cooperation, <laughs> but whatever you did, it was worth it. What about the Rachni? I wouldn't have believed it, but the Rachni are helping us build the Crucible. You're kidding. Turns out they have a knack for weapons of mass destruction. Yay! In hindsight, I guess they'd know a thing or two about waging a galactic war. No problems with them, then? Other than scaring the hell out of our engineers, no. Not a lot of small talk going on there. <laughs> How about the Solarians? Interesting wrinkle. We've been getting back channel commitments from the strike teams within STG. They're promising to back I us. know it! Even after I cured the genophage? Our intel suggests there are cracks developing between the military and the politicians. These STG guys know the score. Oh, they do. They're not going to jeopardize the entire Solarium Union just because some Delatras didn't get her way. Mm-hmm. Do you know how the other races are doing against the Reapers? Believe it or not, the Turians and Krogan actually seem to be getting along. They're kind of similar. Heard not Rex has deployed troops, and they're giving the Reapers a moment of pause. The Solarians are still hanging on to Sir Kesh, but the Reapers are starting to breathe down their necks, too. What about the Asari? They have to be feeling the heat. The Reapers are moving fast with the obvious intent of taking Thessia. Interestingly, the Reapers are leaving Parnak alone. It's the Yogg homeworld. Can't say that I blame them. Yogg have teeth. Eh. Well, if we lose this war, it might be them running the next cycle. Yeah. It's easy to forget the Reapers don't destroy every species. Just the ones who can threaten them. Any word on the Volus and Elcor? The Turians and the Krogan sent forces to the Volus homeworld, Evroom. It might not be enough, but at least they've got Reaper forces bogged down in a nasty ground war. As for Elcor, they're still in the fight, though our projections show the Reapers encroaching on their territory soon. What happened to the Batarians? Never stood a chance, hit by the Reapers straight out of the gate. And without any allies to call on, I think the Batarians are history. There's not gonna be much left of them. Have we heard anything from the Quarians or Geth? Something might be brewing near the Geth border, but our intel is sketchy. News is getting harder to come by as things get worse. Yep. Yep, yep. Nothing more, sir. Keep me posted. Hack it out. Oh, buddy. So much. So much happened.
Or not Rex. That's him on Vermeer, I think. Yay, Krogan Clans. Mm hmm. I wonder what the Krogan Force would be like with with Eve still alive. Hmm. Of what? Oh, right, the one. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Krogan mercenaries. Excellent. A formidable force. Yep, they have the discipline. And now we have the entire seventh fleet as well. That's doing the, oh, right, 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 the banner. They're helping with the Citadel as well, or the Crucible, whatever, whatever. Look at that. We are now over the necessary minimum rating to win the war. We wouldn't win it easily, though. I'm pretty sure. I've never done it, but... I always, well, the one one time I play this, I max out the bar for sure. Time to walk around chatting with people. See the bids of the Maw taking down the Reaper? Man, I wish I could have been there. I'm just glad the diplomats are off the ship. A Krogan and a Turian in the same room is a fight waiting to happen. No, not anymore. Commander, Admiral Hackett has requested your help with a Cerberus fighter base on Navaria. Navaria! The Turians have given us top-level access to their combat data. Their ships are already moving in to help the Alliance fleet. You actually secured a Krogan-Turian alliance. It's one thing to hear about Commander Shepard. It's another to see her in action. Tee-hee! Tee-hee-hee! Flattery will get you everywhere. Pharos. Oh, yes! Right! Colony is our home. We've survived. We're still fighting from Shiala. Right. We feel each This is what happens on Ferris. Oh, nice. Wow. The connection to the people helped drown out the Reaper voices. Yep, yep. They're not sure how it will affect themselves, but the colonists of Pharaohs are still connected. General Corinthus. Oh, yes. Making babies. <laughs> We're all to take the Turians now, since apparently they forgot how to hold a gun. From Daltris Linran. <laughs> oh, it's not like after the the Reapers are defeated, the Krogan are just gonna pop out with a billion fully grown Krogan all of a sudden. It takes them a while to grow up. How come you, is one you? One Dalatras was making these decisions. I feel like it should have been more than just you. Yay, Zeus Hope Colonists. Nice to know you guys are still kicking. I'm kicking good. Kicking back. Garrus! All right, my turn. What's the first order an Alliance commander gives at the start of combat? Uh, I give up. Correct. Ha! <laughs> All right, big guy. What do you call it when a Turian gets killed by a horrible spiky monster? Friendly fire. Come on, that one goes back to Shang-Chi. Ah! How you gotta respect the classics? How many humans does it take to activate a dormant mass relay? 
602. 600 to vote on it, one to ask to be sorry for technical help, and one to request a seat on the council. <laughs> How do you know when a Turian's out of ammo? He switches to the stick up his ass as a backup <laughs> Why does the Alliance hire pilots with brittle bone disease? You're shitting me! The Turian military has one about me? Oh, absolutely. I heard it myself from a private back on Palace. <laughs> All right, why does the Alliance hire pilots with brittle bone disease? So their Marines can beat someone in hand-to-hand -hand drills. <laughs> Damn, you need to tell James that one. Hey, what's the hardest part about treating a Turian who took a rocket to one side of his face? Figuring out which side <laughs> took the rocket. <laughs> You boys! <laughs> Never thought I'd see the Krogan and the Turians team up. Even the Reapers have to be a little nervous about pissing them off. I'd say more than a little. <laughs> I'm sorry about Morden. He was a good man. Yeah, he was always running those tests. And one time he tagged me in the middle of the night to ask how many livers humans had. And this bump on my elbow? He said it was just a mild bone deformation, but... I'm pretty sure he stuck a probe in there. <laughs> I'm glad it was just your elbow. <laughs> I always thought he was crazy. Useful, but crazy. Then he gives up his own life. <laughs> to save the Krogan. Doesn't do much to disprove the crazy theory, huh? <laughs> I guess not. But he was one of ours. So now that we he got was. the Krogan and the Turians, what now? The Krogan help us turn the tide on Palavin. They can shoot at something useful for a change. Dig till we hit daylight, huh? for me so how does it feel knowing krogan will be singing songs about <laughs> the end of time? i think it would be an honor there's enough misery in this universe it's nice to see something go right for a change can't say i've ever really witnessed history in the making yeah you have Garrus. you've been here well, this whole time except <laughs> the citadel and then there was the collector base but you know this one felt good and let's hope rex keeps running the show on tachanka Maybe we should hire a food <laughs> for him. Imagine the carnage if someone like that brother of his Reeve took over. Yeah, that would be bad. That could happen. I know. It's a chance we have to take. But I have to say, if it wasn't my own world that needed the help, I might have taken that Salarian deal. I could never bring myself to do that. No matter what I was offered. I admire your restraint, Shepard. It's nice when we can save the galaxy without destroying... I think last time I actually went down on that one. But really, I don't think Shepard would have been tempted. Let's hope our luck holds. Where's the Edie? I wonder where all the Krogan will live now. I've never seen what you'd call a house on Tachanka. True, just rubble. I wonder where all the Krogan will live now. I've never seen what you'd call a house on Tachanka. Commander. Yeah, I'm like freaking out. See, where is E D in the app figured. If she's not with Joker, she's probably in the AI core. Make sure everyone's doing all right. They can repair damaged atlases too? Holy crap. I did not know that. I just was like, do I have the trials on? Because on Dragon Age Inquisition, you can set trials to make your enemies have the same abilities you have. When normally they don't. Back, Chakwas. Hello, come on. What you doing? What are you up to now? I'm uploading data on the destroyed Reaper to the Turians. They are investigating possible Reaper structural weakness. Our data says Reaper capital ships such as Sovereign are of unique design. However, smaller Reaper destroyers bear similarities. That one was small? Relatively, yes. Ground attack ships are only 160 meters in height. Sovereign was approximately two kilometers. Well, keep talking to the Turians. If there's a chink in the Reaper's armor, we all need to know it. Indeed. Hello, Shepard. Hello, Edie. Joker's got plans for you. 
you're already probably well aware you have plans for your for him for yourself <laughs> so Garrus isn't in there any sign of life the reaper destroyed by the thresher maw appears to be completely inert doctor we would need to send in teams to be sure out of the question tell the krogan to stay away okay the genophage cured the krogan have no reason to hold back now do they rex knows what he's doing but can he keep the krogan in check or i wish he ah! could have seen the rebirth of her people the Krogan won't let themselves fall by the wayside again. Not like they did after the rebellion. So bright. We'll have to get used to them having a bigger part in the galaxy. Heck yeah! I hope the Krogan live up to their ancient legacy, and for the better. Feel free to look around. Thanks! Yep, I remember this one. Shanksy, Theta, unavailable. That's the Turian. Sharon. All right, then, oh, Shanksy is, uh, uh, <laughs> it's the Batarian one, I think. Sharon is Earth. Widow, can't remember, what, Omega, though, we know where that is. It's got a 65% increase, because they're coming out of, well, they're not coming out of there so much. Widow is a 95% increase, that's probably the farthest one out. The increases are where we've seen, are where Reapers are coming in from, but the decreases are where people are not getting out of. At your service. Working our way down the ship, talk, walking fast, Phases past and I'm back in my captain's quarters <laughs> eventually. I've been playing video games all day long. Woo! It's a life. You two need to get together. Get together like shoo-wop, wop wop Come on, them. Do -do 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 -do. Still all right, baby? Good. Commander. Yep, we good? Good. All right, just shaking. Should be nothing downstairs. Blah, let's go talk to this lady. Jennifer here, huh? This beats the hell out of reporting on the Milgram City Council. I don't think I've heard of Milgram. Which planet is that again? Beckenstein. It's right next door to the Citadel. I'm a colony kid. Yep. Well, okay, let me... Commander, got a minute? Yeah. What do you want to know? <laughs> You've just implemented a cure for the genophage. Millions of Krogan will start fighting the Reapers. What do you say to people who think humanity is starting another Rachni war and Krogan rebellions? It's easy to remember the worst of Krogan history, but you also need to remember the best. Meaning? The Krogan were heroes once, and they want to be heroes again. We're giving them that chance. Are you aware that Clan Erdnot is already petitioning the Council for an embassy and rights to a colony world? The Krogan are coming to the aid of a council homeworld. That's more than a lot of species can say. I helped them get the genophage cure. Anything more is between the council and the Krogan. There it is, straight from Commander Shepard. Until tomorrow, this is Diana Allers. Good night and stay strong. Okay, I'll cut that together with the rest of the segment and send it to command for approval. Thanks. Mm -hmm. Meh. I've got the Krogan clans updated. Cool. I heard a rumor that it was supposed to be Emily Wong who was supposed to come with us as the reporter, but the voice actress did not want to, so they had to throw in a new reporter. Boop. Boop. We're not chatting with people? Whoa. Hey. How's it going, buddy? Commander. 
You settling in, Javik? You're right there, buddy. I believe some of the crew wishes to be my friend. <laughs> that is not my purpose. Come on, Javik. Also, I find I need to wash my hands. Right. Do, the ship is oh, okay, okay. That's what he How explains so? it now. I have been exploring. There are traces of those who lived on the Normandy before. I detected a human female. Her genetic structure was unnatural, as if artificially created. Sounds like Miranda. And a drill. There was so. illness in him. Fame. Yeah. And the Krogan we met, who lived in these quarters, he was undergoing a metamorphosis. His memories were confused, not organic to his mind. There was great confusion and turmoil. I still can't wrap my head around that. Reading information like you do. For my people, it was as natural as breathing. Evolution's an amazing force. Indeed. Our scientists believed it was the only force in the galaxy that mattered. They called it the cosmic imperative. The strong flourished. He's learning, though. The weak perished. Javik is learning. The governments of your cycle seem concerned with ensuring the survival of all. Was this imperative just your scientists' opinion, or did they prove something we don't know? The universe had already proven it. They only had to look around. And saw what, exactly? Extinction is the rule of law in the cosmos. The natural order of things. The weakest species are doomed. It's the duty of the strong to protect the weak. Otherwise, we'd have anarchy. But those who had nothing to offer would be eliminated. So conflict should be a way of life. Evolution demands it. The strong grow stronger by dominating the weak. It is for the greater good of all. Though I do not think your Asari approves of my beliefs. Yeah. Liara, I think she just had a different idea about what Protheans were like. We are all a product of our time. Had I been born in this cycle, perhaps I would be the noble scholar she wishes me to be. Interesting. So he picks out. He picked up on that. You think you'd like that? It's a whole different line of work. I wouldn't know. Living a life of constant war, taking life in every battle. I see how it could be tough to see outside the box. Yeah, exactly. It is the only box I have known. It shapes me. A stone is shaped by the one who carves it. This stone has no choice in the form it would take. You and I, Commander, war is our sculptor. And we are prisoners to its design. Maybe not much longer. We win this and we'll both be set free. Yep. Yes, indeed. If the Krogan seek retribution for the past, do not waste time on sterility plagues. Destroy them where they stand. Wait, Nate! More. In the meantime, yes, a difficult fight remains. What? Morality and friendship do not matter now. Your allies are simply resources to use against the Reapers. We just had a lovely talk, Javik. Do not care what others think. Do what you must. Do not care what others think. Do what you must. You just sound like you're trying to convince yourself now, buddy. Javik can't change who he is, but he does start to see things a little differently. We all are a product of our time, of our environments. And while I don't agree with most of the thing, like the, the extreme things he says, you can see the logic in them that he that he has. You know what I mean? Everything is in order. Good. Everything is in order. Okie dokie, Cortez. Just double checking. You think that cure they dispersed could do anything to us? Ah. We're not going to start growing scales or anything. I'd love right? to grow scales. Maybe now that we have the Krogan on board, we can go back to fighting the Reapers. Yeah, James. I was looking at the specs on that Reaper you took out on Tachanka. That was one of the small ones? Don't get me wrong, it's still dead, but damn. There was nothing small about it. Hey. Hey. Yep, yep. Uh, let's get... What is it? The... Yeah, yeah. Base time, there it is. Uh, the 
just do that. Maybe get one of those. And one of those. One of those. Sure, why not? You know what I'm saying? Why not? I get more fish. Right, nope. Ooh, should I just get all no, I don't really want all that I want. I want I want jellyfish. Why are they selling Cerberus armor? Like, you know? Death mask! Looks like the Pathfinder mask that they've been advertising for uh, Andromeda. I don't want too many. I, want, I just actually, I legit just want jellyfish in my tank, but now I've got to have these one other fish species. Cheer me up, buddy. My little koi fish. Did I pick up? I don't know if I picked up any armor. Whew. Capacitor helmet. That's cool looking. That's pretty cool looking. I think I did pick that up. That's a new one. Let's see. Ugh, I am not ready. I'm not ready for the priority citadel yet. Not yet. Wow, ten. Um let's see, Citadel will be fighting a lot of Cerberus. Maybe I should up oh, the sabotage. Somebody mentioned the sabotage. I think it took out a mech, maybe? Is that what they were saying? Increased power duration, increased damage taken by 30%. Wow, 21 second hack. Jeez. So, oh, that, that would be that would be for the mech. That's right. Or for yeah. Maybe we should get disruptor ammo up a little bit more. Hmm. Ooh. Yeah, let's get that. Maybe, maybe it's in a rate. Increases the recharge speed. I think I'm gonna have to go with recharge speed. Excellent, look at that. We're doing very well. Very well. Oh boy, all right, well. I'm gonna have to go now. Sorry if I've been a little lackluster. It's been exciting, though. It's been a very exciting evening of video games for me. Um, but thank you all for putting up with the wait. Hopefully I'll be able to get this out soon. Uh, once again, I'm yeah. I'm, things might, are not going to probably be settled in a schedule yet because I've just got lots to do. Lots of interviews, lots of potential jobs, and all that. Real life sucks. Woohoo. <laughs> But thank you guys for your patience. I appreciate it. Uh, we've got a lot of people at this party, and I'm enjoying it. So I hope you are too. Um, anyway, thanks again. I'll see you in the next one.